yo hello and welcome back to lotus trade again in this video i'm going to give you some tips on how to grow a small trading account so here is the list yes you can read throughout the video this is the end of the video no i'm kidding before we begin throughout the video please consider subscribing for more content like this one over here so don't forget to get the free book or any contribution to get the book that i have made with over 700 pages on this section of the book here is the before and after from 2019 and 2020 so everything in this channel will be updated throughout this book so if you want to get it any contribution will be appreciated so after contributing throughout people you can get this book just contact me on telegram you'll find the link below to get into my telegram group so if you have any problem just comment below then i'll assist you to get the book the link to the contribution will be in the description below you will find some educational content in this in the beginning of this book as you can see from this areas over here i have i explain every movement almost every movement on how the market moves so get it right now so let's begin the video so to grow a small trading account everyone can grow a small trading account you can have beginners luck sometimes without having any strategy but we can we, al we already know that the psychology of this trading is very difficult to accept it so in this case you can still blow your trading account but in this video i'm going to show you how to avoid blowing that trading account so if i can do it you can also do it we are not different i didn't born to trade i just learn over time over time over time that is why right now i have opened this youtube channel so that i can share the information that i have gained over the years so you can still add up to this list in the comment below to help other traders to find this information valuable so my advice to you in this video is that you just have to have a trading plan you see this one here is very important to find a trading plan first of all you need you need a trading strategy you need a trading strategy number two you need to know your account size you need to know your account size what i mean if you need to know your account size is that you need to know if let's say you are trading a 50 dollar account you don't have to open a let's say 0 0.10 on a 50 dollar account you will blow it very quickly because you only have less than 50 pips to blow that account so two trades if you lose two trades then your account is gone then you have to start again so the trading plan is also you need to find those you need to have a trading strategy and then a plan to trade it so the, that strategy you have to write your strategy down the list of the things that you need to see on the market to be to be present for you to execute the trade if those things are not available on your chart then that means you have to avoid those pairs because they don't meet the plan inside your trading plan or the rules inside your trading plan and then number three you need to open at least one or two trades per account you don't need to go more let's say maybe you need to trade only one or two trades per week so my advice to you is that avoid higher trading on the higher time frame because the risk there will be higher because right now we need to grow a small account so meaning we can trade from four hours going to the 15 minutes if you have a lot of time on the screen that means 15 minutes is good enough here we use small lot sizes even if it's a ten dollar account you can still grow it up to five hundred dollar don't ever be discouraged i've done it before so from this small account you can even trade from 0 0.01 and don't even be shy because this is your account don't be, don't even be shy to trade 0 0.01 is there for a reason for a small account and after you have done this things over here 
you will also improve as a trader on how to manage your trading plan because the trading plan is more important than, than trading you just have to know that and this one over here you just have to avoid signals avoid signals because they won't make you a better trader at the end of the day avoid signal this one is a red flag avoid signals improve yourself as a trader individually because nobody is going to care for you if you lose that money i hope we understand each other on this one signals won't make you a better trader at the end of the day i hope you understand each other on this one guys be a better version of yourself at the end of the day you'll be thankful that you have created yourself or you have you have another skill that you can show off rather than showing off your signals learn from the signals but improve as a trader and finally you can also do it brothers and sisters if there's sisters watching here if you are there please like the video sisters so that we can we can improve all so my fellow brothers and sisters we can all do it you can all do it you can all do it don't ever be scared of the market you can all do it if someone did it before you can also do it but there will be some mistakes along the way because we as people don't learn or handle things the same way so we some of us we take time to learn some of us can learn even faster than others so that's how it is so we can also do it if someone did it before you can also do it but what you have to do the most important one is this one trading plan is this one find the strategy use a smaller lot size and then that's it so i guess this is the end of the video guys please consider subscribing we are closer to 1000 subscribers and i would like to appreciate those ones who are subscribed to the channel i love you all so leave a comment below see you on the next one Bye-bye, guys.